Hey, welcome to Out and About with John and Judy. And let's look at the map to see where we're going today. We're going down here to Woodbury, Georgia. Right in here near Warm Springs to Red Oak Creek. Red Oak Covered Bridge. Built by Horace King in 1840. And about 130 or 40 miles away. And let's get started. Hey, we're headed down to uh, Red Oak Creek. Uh, old covered bridge down there built in 1840 by Horace King. Uh, it's the last surviving covered bridge, I think, in Georgia built by Horace King. His sons built a lot of bridges and stuff like that. But it was built in 1840. It's been used for 182 years. 182 years every day. Uh, the local traffic still uses that. I, I wish they could make a state park down there and, and, and all, but they do, the na the neighbors and the people nearby and the local community protects it and uh, takes care of it. And uh, But it's been used all these years, 1840. Uh, and you can still drive through it. And it was built before the telegraph, the telephone, uh, 20 years before the Civil War. Uh, before the automobile, the airplane, uh, all these years people have been going across in horseback, stagecoach, wagon. Uh, they didn't have a Home Depot, they had to build a sawmill nearby and, and saw the lumber for it and uh, it was built to last. Uh, all built with pegs, 2,500 pegs and no nails, no split wood. Uh, the sides of it are hard pine. Uh, which resists weather and termites and uh, just supposed to last for decades but they last for a hundred years 182 years uh, but it's just amazing Horace King's story is amazing uh, and I'll say more about it as we go but uh, from slave to master bridge builder to state legislator in Alabama uh, it's a story it's a story and why somebody hasn't made a movie about his life, I don't know. Tyler Perry, uh, Clint Eastwood, Ron Howard. Somebody make a movie about this man's life. It's unreal. You need to look it up and, and see what all he went through, what all he accomplished. It's amazing. But I love covered bridges. I love the way they're built, they're designed, and uh, just the amazing work that went into them. It's amazing. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I wanted to show it where we walked through it, showed as much of it as we could, and drove through it. And we got a couple of videos following this one that goes along with it. So I hope you enjoy it. Red Oak Creek. This is what we came to see. Still here. And you can drive through it again. Let's get up here where we can read this right here. And cut grass today and taking care of it. Hey, Judy. Been here since 1840. I'm gonna walk through it one time. You wanna walk through it with me? No. Okay. Just got the things too. Look at this. Huh? Look at this. Hmm. 
Yep. That's the long approach. Picnic areas out here. Today is Thursday, May the 5th, I think, 2022. But I understand June, July, and August is a lot of people come down here and go swimming or get in the creek have picnics with family and have a lot of local people that take care of the bridge and look after it and do patrols to make sure no harm comes to it. Well, I definitely wanted to film every inch of it coming down through here. and say we walked it all this morning. Wait a minute three times, makes sense. This bridge started out having people on horseback, wagons, mules. That's how they got around. Coming over this bridge, connecting one side to the other, connecting farming communities where they can take their crops and harvest into town. Absolutely beautiful. The fact that we drove 135 miles from home, we left out at five o'clock this morning. It's uh, eight o'clock. <clears throat> we beat most of the traffic. Certainly worth the trip to see this crown jewel of Horace King, the Prince of bridge builders. I'll uh, film in a minute show underneath it has no superstructure, has no steel or whatever. It's the town lattice construction up here that each thing holds the other thing. It all, one thing supports the other and that's how he was able to build long spans stretch long creeks just a beautiful day
all this workmanship. They have to diligently look after this to keep the graffiti, the carvings off, the, the paint and graffiti is much worse, they said, than the carvings. But it looks like they've kept it in great shape. Look at that. It's amazing. Amazing. Absolutely beautiful. down here without breaking my neck. <laughs> There's the underneath. No superstructure. All still put together with pegs. It's just as straight as it can be. 182 years old. Wow. Still serving the community.
Hey, I hope you enjoyed that video of Red Oak Creek, Red Oak Covered Bridge built by Horace King in 1840. 1840, still used today in 2022. Uh, I hope you enjoy our videos out and about with John and Judy. Please subscribe, like, and comment. And we hope to keep doing these, and especially the covered bridges, anything with history and murals and small town Georgia. Uh, we hope to keep doing. Please uh, check out our next two videos. The next one is going to be in Pine Mountain where they had an exhibition of Horace King uh, about his life, uh, the things he did, and it really explains a lot of it. And I filmed it in a way where I think you can read all about it. It was really good. And then the video after that is in LaGrange, Georgia, where Horace King is buried. And there's some amazing things going on there. So I hope you check those two videos out. I uh, hope you have a great day, and God bless you.